from Taj Mahal Medics. I've got a Citroen C5 here on a 2015 plate. Uh, just doing a rear stop lamp on this one on the passenger side, which isn't working. So the rear one, the position lamp and the brake light works together. So if you switch the lights on, position lamp will come on. When you press the brakes, the light will go brighter. I'm going to show you exactly which one it is in a second. Press the brakes for me, please. Now, as you can see, that one there is working. This one isn't. Now, switch the lights on. Now, you can see there, that's working. That one there is working as well. Press the brakes. Brilliant. Now, let go of the brakes. Lights off. Now, to do it, it is a simple procedure. I'm just going to show you right here. First thing first, I'm going to remove this cover. This cover is quite easy to remove anyway. And then on the inside, it's a good thing you've got a lot of space. So there's that top one there. As you can see, this is the one we need to take out the, uh, the screw. What I need to do first is unplug it. So if I push in, wiggle, wiggle with the plug out. Always remember the plug as well so the connectors are clean. They're not rusty or anything because the Citroens and the Persians are quite prone on electrics. So get this out of the way and then you undo it. If they are really tight, you may be able to use a plier on it or something, you know? I'm not gonna take it out all the way. So what I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this thing here to push it, push it, push it back, basically push it forward, wiggle, wiggle. As you can see, that's all nice and loose. So you can see there as well, it's all nice and loose now. So what I do is undo it all the way now this, this thing, I'm going to need a second pair of hands. The bulb you need is a three, got it already. It's a 380 bulb, that's what you need. You can find a link for it in the description. Uh, if you did want one and where to get it from as well. I'm just going to put this right here. So basically this is it. So all you then do is, you've got a couple of clips here, so you've got a clip here and a clip there as well. So you push this clip back and then pull the tail, uh, the cluster backwards. That's it. That's out. Now remember the seal as well. So when you do take it out, just make sure the seal goes back in as well. If you find this video useful and it saved you a lot of money, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and there is a special thanks button as well. Don't forget to click on that. So get the new one out. It's like recording and putting things together. It's not as easy as anyone could think of. Put it on, job done. And then what I'll do now is I'm gonna put it back together. So I'll make sure I get it right. So it goes in like this basically. That's it. Until you hear a click. Good. Good. And you can see that's all in. Okay. Just remember how it goes back on as well. So you've got these little lugs right here. So it goes through there and then there as well. So what I'm going to do now is line this up into the hole and then gently push it forward that's it I now plug it in first I'm going to screw it in and then plug it in after that You don't need to go too mad on this. All you gotta do is just snip it up. That's it. And then plug in. Now we're gonna check, see, make sure the lights are working. Could you press the brakes for me, please? And you can see that there is working. This one's working as well. Now, let go of the brakes. Lights on. That's it, press the brakes. Brilliant, that's all good. 
Right, that's all it was on this particular model. It is a Citroen C5 on a 15 plate. If there is anything else you need to know, comment us below. We'll try helping you as much as we can, where we can as well. And there is a playlist for Citroen as well. Do check that out. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also the special thanks button. Thank you and goodbye.